Hey guys, Tabin Florida here, and I'm near Savannah, Georgia, and I'm at the Savannah Ogeechee Canal. Uh, it was chartered in 1824, and the canal was uh, constructed between 1826 and 1830 by African and Irish laborers who moved thousands of cubic yards of earth. Uh, Abunda, Georgia's economy, the canal moved cotton, rice, bricks, and natural fertilizer. The lumber industry re uh, revived canal usage following a Civil War era. But a yellow fever epidemic blamed on the canal caused a further decline. The canal closed in the early 1890s as the canal, as I'm sorry, as the central of Georgia Railroad served transportation needs. Beginning of the, at the Savannah River, the canal comprises six locks and 16.5 miles ending at the Ogeechee River. So let's have a look at this thing here. This is a uh, Series of locks. This is lock number five. That's what it says. are pretty old. Kind of growing over quite a bit here. Definitely been here a long time though. So if you come here, there is a uh, boardwalk system. Uh, it's fairly slippery. Uh, I don't know if they need to pressure wash it or or what, but uh, I opted for this nice little hiking trail here that's actually right next to the canal because the boardwalk is just too slippery to walk on. So if you could do go on through and you Check out the boardwalk. Be careful. So you see the canal here, and you see the trail here right next to it. And if you look off in the woods there, you'll see the boardwalk. So it's not too far off the canal. It just kind of takes you through the trees out toward the uh, river. Definitely worth a stop. Uh, as far as from a history standpoint goes. If you come here, uh, my suggestion um, is just to park in the main parking lot. And uh, you know, you're know you not gonna walk any more than 10 or 15 yards to one of the locks. And that's uh, pretty much what it looks like here. So there's, some, there's any need to Hike the whole thing. Uh, well, from the standpoint that it is, uh, this whole area is very historic other than that. But that's the only lock here. And there were a series of them. Uh, there is a makeshift, uh, the, one of the working pieces of the lock itself is here but it's been rebuilt. So it's not an actual piece from it. So, but I am gonna continue on this. Looks like this path has now turned into a boardwalk. And uh, this boardwalk's a lot better. Um, I don't see, like I said, I don't see another lock here, just the one by the parking lot area. So very quick stop. You know, out of here in probably 10 or 15 minutes. Um, or you could stop here and have lunch. There is a little museum here. So that's pretty cool. Turns out there is another lock here in front of me. Let's check that out. Okay, so 
Here's one other lock here. This is a lock G. Oh, I don't know why um, the other one's lock number five. And this is lock G. Unless that's a worn off six. It could be. So, pretty cool though. Pretty cool. Apologize for that. And there's the river. Right here. Sorry, let's see if I can uh, show you the lot going backwards here. Pretty cool. Been here a long time. Anyways, if you're on this area, generally st uh, stop by and see this place. Uh, so it's a pretty quick visit, but I think you'll enjoy it.